हेलो हाय गुड मॉर्निंग हाय गुड मॉर्निंग मेघा राइट यस ओके दिस इज विद सेशन विद क्लैपिंग गो नंबर ऑफ सेशन इट इट इज अबाउट 24 Okay, it is around twenty. So. Um, yes, around twenty fourth session. Yes. Have you been informed of any topic for today's session? Yeah, I got topic, and the topic is uh, what if you won the lottery? It means regarding winning a lottery. Yeah, yeah, win the lottery. Sorry. So don't worry. So let us just go. On, you know, speak normally. Whatever you wish to speak about, you don't necessarily have to speak on the topic of the day. Yes, I don't want to talk about this topic. Okay, okay. Then let's just go ahead and speak. Tell me, um, what do you want to speak about? It's not like any specific. We can talk about uh anything else mm -hmm. except except this topic. Do you wish to speak about uh, the pandemic and the coronavirus that is spreading? Yeah, we can talk, talk about that. Yes. yes. Okay. So, how was your lockdown period? What did you do during that time? Okay. So, my lockdown was I I was like yeah that for me it was good because I. had enough time to do something else in my life which i really want to do wanted to do wanted to do yes uh, because uh, uh, after lockdown uh, has had occurred we got leave means we got we we uh, did our work from home okay mm -hmm. we started so, working from home yes yes so we had a lots of time to to do something else Mm -hmm. and i did it i uh, explored so many things uh, during lockdown and that like was what? making youtube channel okay 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 yeah. you started your youtube channel yes yes i okay. started my youtube channel and i worked lot of my communication skill of my speaking you worked skills. on my communication skills okay. on I, my i worked on my communication skills mm -hmm. i learned uh, so many things regarding sh uh, sh uh, share market and um, how to build your communication skill and how to learn english i uh, i got uh, i i got knowledge about so many things regarding english or again like like the word gained also i gained a lot of knowledge about different subjects yes yes i gained knowledge uh, um, regarding english i mean in a grammatical way in terms of pronunciation in terms of vocabulary mm -hmm. so i spent spent time on this thing my lockdown was <laughs> i got a lot of rest okay and yeah that, okay. Mm. this and what has been also, the post effect of your lockdown do you feel there has been a negative post effect of your lockdown <laughs> mm, uh, see uh, everything has a pros and cons uh, the the thing i uh, spoke with as pros and cons pros and cons yeah so i spoke about plus uh, positive side but at the same time i i uh i had experience of some negative energy as well because we cannot we couldn't go outside of the home of home we uh we, we couldn't yes. yeah, i mean we, that has like stayed with you are you still you know you think a lot about going outside or you yes, just for only important things that is what i do i only step out for important things yes and you know uh, what is the biggest drawback was i i i i am talking about my myself means i was watching all the time news and all that and in news you know every time uh, they are they were talking about corona pandemic how the things were going on and it it made some negative impact on our minds it mind. had a negative impact yeah it had a, it had a negative impact on uh, my mind mm -hmm. and i i felt like i was stuck in my home 
I couldn't go anywhere. It, it was like that. So sometimes it it was irritate irritate irritating for me, mm -hmm. and uh, I went through this feeling. So this is a negative part part of lockdown for me. But yes, after post lockdown things uh, were slowly uh, go. Slowly. Things started to become normal. Yeah, things started to become normal, and uh, we can go outside. I yeah. used to go to Mathiran when I was a kid. I haven't oh, been to Mathiran since a long time. You I should go there. Were, yes, there were there are a lot of resorts out there, yeah. and lovely resorts. Okay, lovely and the whole uh, atmosphere, or you can say, uh, very pleasant atmosphere. Means it is completely different if you are going some some other place. Uh, if I am going, going to come, some, huh, if I am going, going to some other place. At the place, and I, if I compared uh, these places, so I, I would uh, prefer to go Mathuram because yeah, there are no uh, no vehicle is allowed. Vehicle is allowed over there. Yes, yes, I, uh, I recollect. Yes, you cannot take your vehicle after a certain distance. There is a yes. place where you have to stop all your vehicles, and then you just have to go walking from there. Yeah, but I think there's a, ro a horse riding out there. You can take a yeah. horse up. Yes, <laughs> we can <laughs> go riding. only through horse riding if you want to yeah. go anywhere by either by walking or uh, horse riding. riding. Yeah. How was your experience riding? It a was love. <laughs> I didn't do that because I love to walk over there. You used to go by walk. You used walking. To go yeah, walking I, rather than you know. I used to go by walking. I didn't. Uh, get that experience but definitely uh, if i will get the chance to go again i will do that <laughs> let's talk about vaccination <laughs> so what i i just want to ask you that uh, now vaccination is started after uh, we have two uh, vaccine covid shield and one more name is covaxin and what do you think that people have that trust in these uh, um uh, what is vaccine. the word and homie they have and... trust in the entire vaccination drive yes yes people took first dose yesterday i saw in news channel i was uh, people took first dose uh, but after that uh uh good uh, means uh, means most of people uh, didn't take uh, their second, second dose. dose okay they yes. didn't go for their second dose yes yes so I think they don't, they, people don't have a trust. No, or I don't they feel, feel it's about people. trust. Okay. Uh, if you take the first dose and if you don't land up for the second dose, either you are being lazy or you are neglecting your health. That is yeah. what is my, you know, opinion. Because if you have taken the initiative to go and get, get yourself vaccinated for the first time, you should go for the second time. Yes. Unless and yes. until uh, the doctor has told you that uh, you need to take rest or delay the second dose because you have some, you know, other side effect or something, that's a different thing. But if you've taken the first dose, you should go for the second dose. And they all are uh, mostly health workers, so they you cannot say that they are not aware of these things. They are yes. very well aware. Mm -hmm. Even after that, they didn't go for it. So it, it I think we question. should do a survey on that because it's really difficult for me to say why they haven't turned up for the second time. Yeah. Okay. They should okay. conduct a survey regarding that. Yeah, I was searching the word indigenous. 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 Okay. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So yesterday, yesterday, Modi, our Prime Minister Modi ji took mm. his uh, yes, he got vaccinated. I saw the picture online. <laughs> Did, did you know the whole story uh, how he made uh, with all that atmosphere lighten up two nurses were yeah. over there and they both were very nervous and very afraid or you can say very anxious anxious mm -hmm, mm -hmm. so they, they were it? obviously they were worried i mean you have to vaccinate the prime minister of india <laughs> Yeah, they didn't know earlier that the uh, Prime Minister is uh, going to take medicine or vaccination. Mm -hmm. Sorry, medicine, vaccination. And suddenly they came to know and they were very nervous. Then Modi ji... They came. were very nervous. The yeah, pronunciation. Just try to focus on the pronunciation sometimes. 
ओके ओके या देवर नवर देवर या देन मोदी जी टॉक टू देम एंड ही टोल्ड टू बोथ सिस्टर्स दैट दिस वैक्सीनेशन शुड बी वेटनरी फॉर वेटनरी केम फॉर वेटनरी आई कैन आई डोंट नो एक्जेक्टली so nurses were, were like were like why we we are not we were not supposed to give you um, what did the word i use veterinary veterinary uh, means the, uh, something which is given to animals uh, animals. animals yes so he, he talked like that with both nurses so like, like that yeah so uh, they both were erased why we are doing to do so so what is it um, asked told with them that uh, you know the politicians uh, skin uh, skin is fat that thick skin that thick, thick skin. skin yeah in hindi moti chamdi wale hote hain politician mm-hmm. to unko yeah. <laughs> yeah. so <laughs> the whole atmosphere was uh, uh, enlightened up yeah. and yeah both nurses were very um, happy after listening they tried to break the ice with them they were nervous yeah. so he just tried to break ice with them and make yeah. them feel comfortable yeah yeah so i i saw all the all these things in news channel and i was very happy to see that how he knows how to tackle the situation how to handle the situation how to make uh, people lighten up or uh, free feel free yes, he is a people's person yeah he knows um, how to you know gel well with people he knows that <laughs> yeah yeah so um Ha uh, yeah you are you were uh, telling me that uh, US uh, lockdown was uh, you what did you say you are taking rest you are uh, I took some rest, rest. Yes. yes i used to just get up uh, have a late breakfast and uh, <laughs> i tried different things also i mean yeah. i tried intermittent fasting okay. <laughs> because uh, i used to have late breakfast so i used it to my advantage then i tried you know um, cooking it was the first time i literally tried cooking i am not oh good god. at cooking <laughs> oh my god i used You're to like good? to eat. no i am not that good at cooking i mean i can do fast foods i can make fast foods i can make pizza sandwich i can make uh, you know the routine fast food that you can normally okay. make i can boil an egg i can make tea and things like that but making a biryani or something like that you know something really different it was first time for me i tried doing that okay means basically we, uh, you can say you are not that interested in cooking i <laughs> uh i wasn't interested in cooking but if i do take an interest then i don't do anything else i just land up in kitchen and i spend my whole day in the kitchen i'm okay. one of those okay okay that's great i also uh, made so uh, many uh, um, uh, dish this mm-hmm. dish during mm-hmm. lockdown that was my first uh, experience. experience or experiment you can say like that <laughs> okay you tried different things and uh, yes. you moved up lo- a lot i suppose yes yes i like to cooking i like to uh, doing work i like to cook yeah i like to you cook. can either say i like cooking or you can okay. say i like to I like cook. to cook yes yeah so uh, yeah i like cooking and i uh, i love to do work in kitchen in kitchen work it is mm-hmm. it is for me like a uh, uh, stress buster kind of thing for me mm-hmm. uh, yeah so i made uh, uh, so many things uh, during lockdown and mm-hmm. uh, yeah i you can i can say like yeah i i um, Uh, make some new thing so in 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 this I tried way, something new yeah i tried something new so in this way i can say that i uh, did some new experiment in cooking isn't it yes i tried baking that was my yeah. first time that i tried baking okay how do you find how do you uh, how do you find baking yeah baking mm-hmm. i feel uh, is good but um it has an influence of western influence on us we uh, as from an indian culture don't really try baking we either yes. deep fry our snacks you know yes. or something like that but we don't routinely use baking baking has a western influence to it it's different 
Okay, it is good. Um, I didn't try the normal baking thing. I mean, okay. during normal baking, you use plain flour. Okay, I was trying to avoid plain flour. I used a lot of different things instead of plain flour, either the wheat flour or either the oat flour. I tried to substitute, you know, the traditional things by something different. Yeah, we we call it maida. You're yes. talking about that? Yes, yes. Maida is called plain flour. Plain? Plain flour. Flour. Plain. Okay. It's plain flour. Plain flour. Okay. I didn't know about this. Thank you. Okay. Flour. Yeah. Uh, see, when you say flour, okay, the way it is pronounced, one is your flour, okay, yeah. your roses and your lilies, flour. okay, okay, and the other is plain flour that you use in the kitchen. So the pronunciation is same for both. It sounds mostly the same. It sounds okay. Yes. Okay. So Some people did... call flower as flower also. You can say flower. So that's what you know. That is the way they differentiate. Okay. Okay. But your meda is called flower, plain flower. 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 Okay. Not flower. Not flower. Not okay. flower. Not flower. 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 <laughs> okay. That's great. Okay, so uh, um, except except baking, did you try anything else? Like I tried, the, uh, yeah, I tried making biryani, okay. but under the supervision of my mom, I okay. can't do it all alone. I tried it for a couple of times, maybe three or four times. So I'm sure I can do it all alone now. Okay, that's great. That's great. So how was the taste of your biryani? No, it it was amazing. It was amazing. <laughs> Okay. Um, Indian cooking, the more spices you put in your dishes, I mean, the, the better the taste is. The more you marinate things, yes. I mean, the flavor, the in, flavor of Indian dishes comes from there. Yes, yes. Spices the, play a lot of important roles. I think uh, Indian flavor is uh, living in the process. Process, how we yes add this. Yes, how we, how much effort we take, how we do each thing that makes a lot of difference in Indian cooking. You can either put something in a pressure cooker or you can, you know, take time, put it on a normal gas.